Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome to Pod Peak. In today's video, I'm going to talk about five amazing YouTube channels that are going to help you master Reaper. First of all, if you're a veteran Reaper user, you already know that we have one of the best communities for learning any DAW on the internet. In fact, there's so much information about Reaper online that it can be overwhelming, especially if you're brand new to Reaper and you're looking for the best ways to get started. So in this video, I'm gonna outline my top five favorite channels for learning Reaper. And if you stick around to the very end, I'll even throw in an honorable mention. Let's dive in. The first pick is Reaper Mania. Reaper Mania, or Kenny Joya, is hands down the best Reaper tutorial creator on the planet. Kenny's a multi-platinum songwriter, record producer, recording engineer, and mixer. And if you watch any of his tutorials, you'll get the sense that he's a total OG in the world of music production, and that he's definitely been around the block and mastered his craft. But perhaps his biggest contribution to the music community or production community as a whole are the hundreds of tutorials that he provides on his Reaper channel for free. First, Kenny has a super interesting communication style. It's a style that's exceptionally clear, concise, and intuitive. In fact, when Kenny introduces his videos by saying, Hi, I'm Kenny Joya. Welcome to another one of my tutorials. It's almost like slipping into a meditative bubble bath for your mind. In addition to his YouTube channel, Kenny's videos are featured on the official Reaper website. Initially, there's so many videos, it can be a little tricky to find what you're looking for. That said, Kenny does have a video geared towards new users titled, How to Watch My Reaper Videos. So if you're new to Reaper, this is probably a good place to start. Some of my favorite videos by Kenny are Removing Background Noise in Reaper, Marquee Zoom, and a series of videos about mouse modifiers. Kenny's videos are for every type of Reaper user, even grizzled veterans like myself. Head on over to his YouTube channel or the official Reaper website and scroll around. I'll leave links down below. Number two on my list, the Reaper blog. The Reaper blog is a place for all things Reaper, plus a variety of other cool audio stuff run by the incomparable John Tidy. Here's an analogy. If Kenny Joya is the Reaper God, then John Tidy is the Reaper Jesus? Dear John, thank you for teaching me how to be a better Reaper user. Also, thank you for forgiving me of my sins. All jokes aside, John and the Reaper blog are an invaluable source for learning and staying informed on all of Reaper's updates. In fact, in addition to an extensive and deep library of essential Reaper tutorials, John does comprehensive overviews of all Reaper updates, which is incredible if you want to stay up to date on all the bug fixes, updates, and overall improvements in the Reaper software. Some of my favorite tutorials from the Reaper blog are customizing the Reaper 6 theme, how to use screen sets in Reaper, and John's custom fast edit mode. Personally, John's been super helpful to me over the years, and he's given me a lot of tips that I use in my everyday workflow pretty much every day. Additionally, John has a Patreon where you can get early access to his videos and other Patreon-only goodies. And he's also available for one-on-one -on -one individual sessions to help with your Reaper questions. So make sure and check out the Reaper blog on YouTube. Number three on the list, let's talk about Reaper. If you've been using Reaper for a while, you've probably seen this guy before. Hey, it's Mike. Let's talk about Reaper. Let's Talk About Reaper is a YouTube channel run by Mike Robinson. The channel is centered around Reaper tutorials, but it also covers topics ranging from recording and editing drums and guitars, as well as plugin reviews and more. Mike's channel is predominantly geared towards beginners and intermediate users, but experienced users might find value as well. Mike's tutorials are straightforward, easy to understand, and they're really useful if you learn by watching someone do things step by step. Some of my favorite videos from Mike are installing SWS extensions, Pro Tools style floating fader in Reaper, and his multiple reviews on the Toucan plugins. In addition to his own channel, Mike's been featured on Warren Hewart's Produce Like a Pro, 
and he teaches a course over at the Pro Mix Academy. Additionally, if you want to support Mike's work, you can find him over on Patreon. Number four on the list, IDD QD Sound. IDD QD Sound is a focused Reaper channel that is predominantly geared towards intermediate and advanced users. The channel is run by Aria Afshar, I hope I pronounced your name right, who's a music producer, sound designer, and a film composer based out of Canada. This guy is what I would consider a mega Reaper expert. Like the amount of knowledge in his brain is staggering. His rapid fire Reaper tutorials get right to the point. They're fast paced and they're packed full of so much useful information. It's honestly mind blowing. So if you're into that kind of thing, check it out. Some of my favorite tutorials on his channel are tab to transient Pro Tools style in Reaper, five awesome custom actions for quick editing in Reaper, and Logic Pro style comping in Reaper. And beyond the Reaper tutorials, there's also some really cool sessions with other Reaper experts, including a super fun and very long interview with the man himself, Kenny Joya. Number five on the list is Reaper Tips. Reaper Tips is primarily aimed at beginner and intermediate Reaper users, and it's one of the newer channels to the Reaper ecosystem, but it's also one of the best. Run by Alejandro Hernandez, Reaper Tips has a small but meticulously curated series of videos that are high quality, easy to understand, and super enjoyable to watch. One thing you'll notice about Alejandro's videos is that they're clean, easy on the eyes, and they're focused on making working in Reaper a pleasurable experience. Some of my favorite Reaper Tips videos are, I made 12 color palettes and toolbars for your Reaper tracks, five advanced ways to edit in Reaper, and I edited all Reaper 6 icons. Reaper Tips has an accompanying website called Reaper Tips where you can find all sorts of blogs, tips, and even a free ebook. And if you like the work that Reaper Tips is doing, make sure and buy him a coffee. Okay, so that's it for my list of favorite YouTube channels to learn Reaper, but I did say that if you stuck around, I'd have an honorable mention. So the honorable mention is Adam Steele's Hot Pole Studios. Adam's a guy who lives across the pond, but he's been around for a while. Although he hasn't done a ton of Reaper focused tutorials lately, his back catalog is chock full of useful videos for beginners and intermediate users alike. Adam has an engaging and conversational style, and it's not uncommon to see him hanging out with Warren Hewitt from Produce Like a Pro or Glenn Fricker over at Spectre Sound Studios. So short and sweet, go check out Adam's channel. Okay, so that's my list. I'm sure that some of you watching this video are gonna have other amazing Reaper channels that you enjoy. So please leave a comment down below and let me know your thoughts. All right, well, that's it for today. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like, subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications so you get updates every time I put out a new video. All right, well, take care of yourselves. Peace out. We'll catch you next time.